peeps and welcome to Train Simulator 2014 with me, Stucker Gloss. My oh, life feels weird saying 2014. Um, we're only in 2013. Okay, so this is the first time I've loaded this up. I, I changed the audio settings. That was that was it. I guess we're going to start a career. Uh, it says start here at drive, but let's do a career and see what see what happens, isn't it? What's the worst that can happen? Stucker Gloss, driver level zero, medal zero, driver status 13 XP. Okay, that's our career. Uh, 318 friends, none online. Oh, career stats. Okay. Oh, okay, so this just tells you what the career... Okay, start here is in drive. So we're going to drive. And we're going to do a career. Take, an, take on a host of challenging career scenarios and earn experience points and medals. Free roam, quick drive. Uh, let's just start with a career, shall we? Control method export. Try simple controls if you're new. Oh, oh yes. Control method simple. Okay. Career. So look at it. We've done that one already on, on our the older one. Uh, big boy billionaire benefactor. Two years ago, a billionaire railroad fan donated millions to get a big boy running on the main crash. 4014 received this this honor, and after years of hard work, it's ready for its debut. This is the first run in 50 years for the big boys, so expectations are high. There are photograph photographers waiting at scheduled points on the way to Barstow, where you need to meet time and speed targets. Also, the benefactor has not missed a trick, and there's so tickets for special run, so do not disappoint on this historic journey. Oh gosh, I think we should ease ourselves in. Maybe do this. Uh, EMD F7 UPRR. It's the late 1970s and the F7 on the line is doing one of its last runs down to Colorado Springs before passenger stops based on a timetable. Yeah, that seems like scoring disabled. Why is scoring disabled? Trouble with goats. The skiing season has begun. You're driving a special to the resort of Disen. However, the mountain goats. I'll come down the mountain to greener pastures. I like to cause delays if they get on the line. Uh, fog on the line. What's this? Yeah, I think we're going to do that one. Okay, go. <laughs> Gosh, I think I need to buy a few more trains because uh, we're doing all the easy ones. I don't know how long this is going to take. It took ages before, but uh, I'll pause it and I'll be back once it's up and running. It's aboard before setting off. I will do. So I've got to remember how this all works again. So open the doors, which is. Which is that? Does that open up the passenger? Probably not. dark in here isn't it? Can we turn the lights on? Uh, actually quite like the outside view. Well not that outside. Nor that one. Nor that one. Nope. Oh gosh I've forgotten how to play this game. Have we... How do you unload? I'm sure that was... Load and unload. Right. Pick up passengers from Castle Rock. Pick up passengers from Larkspore. Okay, we've done that, so we need to go to Larkspore now. Oh gosh. Uh, okay, so let's... Let's go. this do? Request pass signal, danger behind. Oh, denied. Choo choo! Okay, green. Uh, where's the speed limit? Okay, 45. It's all coming back to me slowly. Um, Roger, Roger, Roger. Okay. Right here. 
Roger, Roger, Roger. Um, Larkspore, that's where you need to go. Oh, doesn't the scenery look awesome? Where can I... Oh, helicopter. Ah, there we go. Look at that. That runs lovely, doesn't it? Union Pacific. 1478. Coming through. Yeah. See the scenery on the outside? The trees are real, don't they? Kind of. Let's uh, get back in the train. Let's blow a horn. Oh, that's a bell. Where's the horn? Yeah! So we can ramp it up to 60 miles an hour. Yeah, I kind of forgot one of the, the train signals. I had it kind of locked down last time. I think red means stop, yellow means the next one's going to stop. I think that's that's what it means. We we'll just go with it and see what happens. Uh, we're getting rated on this as well. Um, now the only worry is we're supposed to pick passengers up from Larkspool, Larkspool, and that's there at a certain time, and. Uh, yeah, arrive at 15.48 and depart at 15.49 and we're late departing, so... Four power at Captain. Just can't do it, we haven't got the power. Danger, 600 volts, wow. Bit of horn. Uh. Oh, 65 now. Yep, we're. Uh, let's go check out our passengers quickly. No, it's a bit dark. Um. Guess that's what we can look at, really, isn't it? Oh, green light's good. Slow that down a bit. Oh, there's another train. Carrying a bit of load, that isn't it? Oh, these trains are huge in America. Alright, we're cutting some lights in a minute. Yeah, you want to keep it between 60 and 65, I guess. Uh, we're going up a bit of a slope as well, so we need to keep it. Isn't it that one that uh, puts sand on the track so we can climb up a hill? Oh, cars, wait. I think we've got this. There we go. We should get more traction now. I think that's what that does, isn't it? Put sand on the tracks to uh, help us go up a, up a hill. Yeah, we're, we're doing okay, we're doing alright. Can you see the sand? No. It's a beautiful day! Don't really want to stop here, do we? Is it green? 
it's green. Alright, we're starting to level out a little bit. Let me take the sand off, shall we? No. No, I'm going to leave it on. with that just yet. I'd like to get to one point or we'll just finish this scenario. Pick up from Larkspur. Um, oh it's got a little thing there saying 5.3 miles okay. We're still going uphill. We're losing a tad of speed not much though so I'm gonna keep the sand on and uh, we'll, we'll turn this off when we start to level out a little bit. Yeah, it's coming back to me slowly. I didn't do a test run or anything, I literally just... Uh, well, basically, I bought Train Simulator years ago, and um, they keep updating it for free, which I'm not complaining. You know, I'm glad they do. Uh, I'm going to check the uh, Steam Workshop uh, before the next video and download some uh, some different routes, some new trains and things so we'll have a, a more of um, a selection in the next video yep we're still doing well we're still putting sand on the tracks Larkspur, what time we got to be there? I think 5.48 haven't we? Yeah, 15.48. We've got four miles to go, so I don't think we're going to make it. We'll get there, though. You should be green. Yes, you are. Ah. I can't even see the radio. I was just trying to find out with it. Roger, roger, one, two... Two one Roger Roger. I've never done the old CB radio thing, so I, I, I don't don't really know the uh, the terminology of um, of what to say on a radio. Sixty point seven. Some lights coming up in uh, 1.68 miles. Uh, we're doing all right, I think. I think the sun is definitely helping. We're starting to increase speed now. Seven hundred and seventy-eight gallons of fuel on board. I think it's actually harder going downhill than it is uphill, in some respects. Let's turn off the sun then. Hopefully, we start. Oh wow, we increase the speed quite fast. How are we still increasing speed? We're still going uphill, aren't we? Yeah, we are. There's the lights. It's flashing yellow, which means that the next lights is going to be red. So that's flashing yellow. Yellow and red means caution. I hope. Yep, so we can start to slow down. Put some brakes on. 0.8 of a mile, we've got some lights which might be red, so we just need to uh, make sure we can afford to stop. Oh, 
we slow down a bit too much there. Coming up to a 45 mile an hour speed limit. Yeah, P45. That changes to 45 miles an hour. It's like a big coal plant or something there. Right, these lights might be red. Yeah, we should be in Larkspur, but we're 0.6 miles out. We're late. Uh oh. Never mind. Yeah, these these lights are red. So stop, 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 Okay, we're stopping here until... Where am I stuck? This looks like I went over a red light. No, we're moving. Good. Well, that's just made us even more late. So this is Larkspur, people. Uh, there's the uh, the platform. There should be some peeps waiting. We're only a, a minute and a half late. Not too bad. There they are. Oh, they seem pleased enough to see us. Hello. Give you some some horn to say we're here. I will start slowing down now. See so if we can get as much trailers there as possible. There we go. Okay, so people should be loading and unloading. Yep, everybody wearing the same shirts and pants. What oh, am I moving? Oh, sh sh sh. Stop! Stop! People are still getting on the train as it's moving. Sorry. Whoops. I'm sure that's going to be reflected in my score. <laughs> People are trying to get on a moving plane, uh, moving train. You did not board passengers. Uh, I did. All right, let's go. That should be a tick. Alright, pick up passages from Monument, Monument 2. Let's go. It's because I'm, I moved, I think. They're so picky, aren't they? Let's go. I do love the, the scenery and the uh, and the work they put into um, into these routes. It's like flight simulator, you know, flight simulator. You can spend quite a lot of money on uh, on bespoke trains and and routes and things like that. And I think if you're really into uh, into sort of train spotting or, or you, you really love the train network. I, th I can really see the benefit of it, but um, I'll have a look on Steam, on the Steam Workshop, and see if there's anything there that takes my fancy for next episode. We're on our way to Monument Two, and it's 12 miles away. They get really funny about trains moving in the platform, don't they? 
wonder if I can see anybody in... Anybody? No. I tell you, instead of just the throttles, it's like me being a back, you know, back seat passenger. It's quite, quite a big train, isn't it? You see all the peeps on there. See if we can get to uh, Monument in yeah a little while. It's got 14 minutes to get there. Sand. Just going up another incline. That's a good speed. It's going to change to uh, 55 miles an hour in a second. There we go. Oh, it hasn't changed to 55 miles an hour. Oops. Now it's changed to 55 miles an hour. Game! There's some lights coming up. I think they're green. I hope they're green. Yeah, I can see a green dot at the top. So we like to see green lights. Green is good. Right, this is a bit of a hill. It's like a long slope. Well, considering I haven't played this game for for a long, long time. I don't think I'm doing too bad, to be honest. You know, the train's moving forward. Um, or we might have hurt somebody on the platform, but in my defence, um, yeah, I've got nothing really. Um, but yeah, we're doing well. guys on the radio are really positive, you know, they're uh, telling me I'm doing a great job. <laughs> oh. Union Pacific. Now, is that the manufacturer of the train, Union Pacific, or is that like the train, is that like the company who owns the, the railroad? Mountains are awesome, don't they? Look at that hill. Right, we're coming up to. Now we should theoretically be going down in speed. Why are we increasing the speed? We're going up a slope. Ah, there we go. American food. That's what the sign said, I think. Okay, it's green. Give us some beeps. Wake up the person who's working in the service station. God, this is a long sloop, isn't it? OK, 
Okay, so we might be on track. Uh, get it on track. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, sixteen oh seven, and we're at fifteen fifty seven at the moment. Oh, that's nice. We're just keeping uh, keeping the same speed there. Turn the lights on. It's starting to get a little bit dark. Let's have a look what that looks like. Yeah. So 1.2 percent. Okay. That makes sense. It looks a lot more than 1.2 percent, doesn't it? slightly. No, I'm happy with that. Yeah, I think that button goes off, doesn't it? When you come, come past that, and then there's something you need to worry about the next one. So if this is yellow, the like, alarm goes off, uh, like the next traffic light is going to be red or something like that. But it hasn't gone off yet, so I guess it's just green all the way. Well, it looks like we're in the middle of nowhere, so I don't think this is a busy train track. No, nope, 45 miles an hour, is it? Coming up. So it's green and red. It's so confusing. Well, let's have green, green, yellow, yellow, red, red. Yep, just keep going. Is that a 45 mile an hour? I think it is, but it doesn't change the 45 mile an hour straight away. So if I just back off just a tad. There we go. By the time he hits it, we should be. By the time it changes to 45 miles an hour, we should be around 45 miles an hour, hopefully. You watch, as soon as it hits that, it's going to go to 45 miles an hour. Quite close to the, um, the train station. Then. So 1.5 slope. Ah, looks like it's going to drop, go down, go down the hill, which I think is harder because you have to ride the brake a bit more. over the peak and then uh, looks like we're going to start going downhill. Green, red. Mm -hmm. 
reminds me of um, Underground Simulator because that's it was a little bit like that. You had to row between uh, you know forwards and backwards to get the right speed. Okay, we're 44 miles an hour. Just going around this corner. Um, yeah, we're due there in uh, four minutes. Our ETA is uh, 16:08, so we're gonna be a minute and a half. Well, we knew it was a minute and a half. Okay, so it's yellow flashing, which means in the next. The next um, traffic lights might be red, so we just need to keep an eye on that. Oh, we're speeding. That's alright. Forty four point eight. Step a little bit. Well, it's breaking quite a lot, isn't it? Just even minus three percent. Well, that's okay. So there's no sign for the uh, no sign of the of the traffic light just yet. Yeah, all the carts are on the track, which is a good sign. Let me just slow down just a bit. A bit more. There we go. I don't think they should penalise me for speeding over like one mile an hour, because that don't seem fair. It's difficult to control it. You know, like one mile an hour, even in cars, you know, like you got a 70 mile an hour speed limit. By law, you're allowed 10%. So, I shouldn't get done for speeding for that. That's a bit naughty if they do. There's a traffic light, so we need, might need to slow down a bit because that might be red. It's half a mile away. Right around this corner. I don't want to risk it. I'd rather be late than uh, run a red light. I can't see. How can I zoom in? Oh. It's red, green. So I guess that's okay to go. It's frustrating, isn't it? Red, green. Breaking slowly. There we go, just riding the brake a bit there. We've got half a mile to go to Monument 2. Uh, 16.07, we should, <laughs> we should be there by now, but... Uh, not there. Let's slow down a bit. Uh, 
it. Twenty miles an hour. That's a good speed, isn't it? Just, just start coming to a stop slowly. Oh, I like that a lot. Ah, it looks good. There we go. People are getting out. Let's check. So it was only a min just over a minute. You know, a minute twenty. It's not too bad. Oh, I think they actually take take the time. Okay. Uh completed the action as well, so you've got to be here way before. That's not fair. You have reached the final stop, but did not complete all tasks. Try again. Is that it? Targets complete 183. Move the train once while unloading, speeding eight times. Uh, rail engines experienced. Well, there we go, peeps. We didn't do too well on our first attempt at, uh... Oh, get tutorials here. I must build. Does that mean we could build our own... Select a route. Okay, you can select a route, and then... Oh, I see. Well, okay then, peeps. Thank you very much for watching. This is our first delve into uh, Train Simulator 2014. Uh, like I say, I'll try and get some more uh, routes sorted and uh, new trains. And, uh... Learn how to do it, really. <laughs> So uh, take care. Thank you for watching. My name is Stocker Gloss. Ciao for now.